goes from physio crew this um my dog Sasha she's dying to go for a walk so we'll make this quick um I just want to do my review of the day which is for a, um, a fleece rug so it's um Cadence which is one of the country and wide brands um I've gone for it just because it's cheap and cheerful I really needed um a rug that would sort of wick away all of the um, sweat and cool her down so um, that's why I've got the fleece so I'll just bring it for a close up so you can have a little look and what it looks like I'm just gonna um, open it up for you so it comes in a nice easy package um, just to zip open I've got another one of these rugs as well which has been amazing and so user friendly that's why I bought this one um, and this is really nifty as well you can keep all um, other bits in it I mean I don't keep my rug in it I actually keep my riding gear in it and I can keep it just outside so it doesn't get wet um, so it comes with all of the um, the packaging in terms of the washing instructions. So I'll just quickly read that for you. So it says it's 100% polar free, um, fleece. It's breathable, wickable and warm. Um, it's machine washable, which is really, really important, especially if um, you've got a horse like Rhea who's sweating regularly. I mean, she's really, really unfit at the moment, which is why. Um, but it's good to be able to put just something to um, keep them warm, but also allows that moisture to get out. Um, got cross uh, singles and a fillet string. Um, I did have, um, I put a rug on her the other day and I'd taken the fillet string off. So just remember, it's really important to put the fillet string on. As when I came back, it was all tangled up around her. So um, yeah, make sure you've got the fillet string as well as the crossover sir singles. Um, so this one, it talks about the sizing as well. So there's a little chart on it, um, but she's a kind of a, my horse Rio is sort of 16, well, I was told she was 16.3, but other people are saying they feel she's more like 17 hands. But I put a 6.3 um, rug on her, but there's um, lots of different sizing charts depending on the, the brand that you go for. Sometimes you don't have to go for the top brand. I mean, I absolutely love Rumbo rugs, but I can't afford £250, £350 to get the best. So yes, if you've got loads of money, go for that. But if you're a bit like me and you need a sort of a medium brand, then um, Cadence has been really good. Caring for the rug says it can be um, machine washed on a gentle cycle at 30 degrees and using mild, using mild soap. Um, drip dry, wash separately to others. <laughs> you will find with this type of thing, if you wash it with other things, it will um, it will stain the other one. So make sure you just wash it separately. Um, and um, and Countrywide recommends using a professional rug and cleaning reproofing service. Of course they do, but <laughs> you can probably do it yourself. Um, and um, this tells you a little bit about the um, user guides and, and country and wide farmers. Um, a great shop. I mean, I use it quite a lot, um, but obviously some things you can do yourself. So just looking at the front straps of these, they're really nice, easy sir singles. So you can see you've got the clip like so. A little bit different from the Rambo ones, which will often, um, you can just see that one there. So they're really easy. And um, just for you, those of you who haven't necessarily seen horses before, what you do is you just link them through like this and turn. So it's so simple. So if you're, if you're looking at putting that on really, really quickly, it's great. You've also got um, a little, let me bring this one in a sec. You've got something here as well which tells you the washing advice. So when you chuck that one away, if you can't remember, um, so it's saying use non-detergent soap, cold machine wash, um, but they have said you're allowed to put it to 30 degrees. Um, and um, they've actually um, said that you line dry it. And they've actually said you can cool tumble dry, but only for 10 minutes. So this one here, it shows you is an outshell of 100% um, anti-pill polar fleece, size 6 foot 3, and then it just gives you some of the numbers um, in case you needed to send it back. So just looking in a little bit more detail. So it's got um, some nice print um, sort of embroidery. So just literally for the look of it on the outside, just around the neck. Um, you've got an extra padded bit just around um, the withers. Um, and, and again, it, I don't know if you can see that very well, but it comes into a little circle, um, semicircle there, um, which is really, really helpful to stop them rubbing. And I'll just hold it up so you can see it there. At the back, you've got these two little um, extra straps here, which just um, help to shape it at the back. And you can see the fillet string. Um, there's nothing fancy with that. You just tie it one side to the other by these little hoops here. So not a particularly fancy one of those. You can get the little clip ones um, if you prefer those. But once that's tied up, you don't ever have to do anything with that. That You just literally slip it under the tail. Okay, so you can see it up there on the side but fairly standard rug um, and I'll let you know how I get on with it I mean it's a standard fleece so I'm, I don't expect it's going to be particularly different from other fleece it's the material really but hopefully it won't cause any rubs or sores I'll keep you informed um, 
and yeah, so that's Cadence, and it's a country and wide farmers um, one. Brilliant, I hope that's been helpful. Um, subscribe below if you um, want to keep in touch and um, see more reviews. Take care, bye.